Belgium is a true gem of the European Low Countries. It may be small, but boy does it pack a punch. Between its borders, this country hosts everything from lively European parliaments to somber war memorials, ranging from the Francophone villages of Wallonia in the south to the Flemish Diamond Cities and North Sea Coast. Be sure to plan your travel itinerary with our list of the best places you should visit in Belgium. Before we start, be sure to like and subscribe to see more amazing sights. Number 5. The Belgian Coast The white, sandy Belgian coast runs over 65 kilometers, allowing you to visit many diverse communities without feeling overwhelmed. There's also the De Custrum, a public coastal tram that begins near the French border at De Pan and runs all the way down to Nachheist, near the Dutch border, making 68 stops in total. The entire trip takes two and a half hours and allows you to see the coastline from the luxury of your seat. De Haan and Oes Duinkirk are two must-see locations. De Haan is unique in that all buildings must be no taller than five stories, preserving the village's historic attractiveness. Many people fall in love with the low beachside skyline made primarily of Belle Epoque houses and pristine grassy dunes. Number 4. Antwerp Antwerp, Belgium's second city, is also its coolest, thanks to the world-renowned Royal Academy of Fine Arts. Some of fashion's greatest creatives, including Martin Margiela and Balenciaga's Demnig Veselia, have Antwerp roots, and a few have gone on to build unusual boutiques worth a visit, such as Dries van Noten's Het Motopalius, and Anne de Mullemeester's sleek, black-and-white flagship store. More stylish boutiques may be found in the fashion district's Kamenstraat and National Estrit sectors. The magnificent Fashion Museum Antwerp is also located here. Aside from its elegant residence, the city has a visual edge due to its various architectural styles. Recent contemporary developments have joined the medieval structures, adding to Antwerp's rich environment. Make your way down to the waterfront to see architect Zaha Hadid's Antwerp Port House and the MAS, which houses exhibitions and artifacts centered on Antwerp. Number 3. Brussels Brussels, Belgium's capital and the headquarters of the European Union and NATO, is one of Europe's most multicultural towns. Art aficionados can spend a whole day at the Royal Museum of Fine Arts of Belgium, which is comprised of six separate museums, including the must-see Magritte Museum. The city is full of architectural marvels, such as the Grand Place, a UNESCO World Cultural Heritage Site, and the famed Maison Kachi, which is only open to the public on the first weekend of the month with advance reservations. Brussels is the place to go for foodies who want to sample all of Belgium's gastronomic treasures. Delirium Café is a popular, always crowded café that serves over 2,000 different types of beer, including the country's famous Trappist brews. There are a few outside kiosks nearby where you can get your Friatin fix. To satiate a sweet taste, try Pierre Marcolini's Belgian chocolate and, of course, Maison Dandoy's fluffy Brussels-style waffles. Number 2. Ghent Ghent, located between Brussels and Bruges, has twisting canals, medieval buildings, outstanding museums, and cobblestone streets teeming with shops and restaurants. Take a deeper look, and you'll discover an out-of-the-box creative culture, a thriving music scene, and enough drool-worthy plant-based menu selections to make the city the vegetarian capital of Europe. Ghent has been a UNESCO creative city of music since 2009. There's something for everyone's taste, from Belgium's first silent disco at a bacho to performances at the never-boring Vouruit Art Center, and from classical performances at De Beechloek Music Centrum, to live music on the street and in bars and cafes, like Kinky Star, a local record label-owned cafe famous for its Irish coffees and alternative concerts. Number 1. Bruges Visiting Bruges is like entering a fairy tale. With its intricate network of tree-lined canals, cobblestone alleys, and well-preserved buildings, the city is often referred to as the Venice of the North. To add to the charm, much of the distinctively medieval architecture, thanks to the red Gothic brick, resembles gingerbread cottages. All of this, as well as the fact that it is the cradle of Flemish primitive art, 
contributed to the designation of the entire historic city center of Bruges as a UNESCO World Heritage Site. Bruges is best enjoyed at your own speed. Wander through Old Town on foot, taking in the historic squares, then take a canal boat trip and count all the bridges before biking along the canals to the less congested spots. Head to the Belfort, one of Bruges' most famous structures, for the best bird's eye views. Catch your breath with a refreshing Belgian beer, which can be found on almost every corner of the city. Last but not least, no trip to Bruges is complete without a stop at the Groningen Museum, a fine art museum with an exceptional collection of Flemish primitive art. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to like and subscribe to see more wonderful places to visit. Comment your favorite places and we will make a video showcasing it.